Welcome back to HLN Now. We've got a hero story for you, and we're talking about a two-year-old who was the hero. There he is. Look at little Bentley. And look at him working that smartphone. That's what he used to help save mom. Mom's name, Laura Toon, and here's what happened. Mom is walking a foster dog and with their other dog. So foster dog turns mean and attacks and bites their dog. So mom has to get in there and try and break this up. While she's doing that, she's getting bit viciously. Sounds like she almost is going to lose one of her fingers. So she comes back home. She's bleeding everywhere. She's about to pass out. She needs some help. Her two four-year-old uh, little girls, they're so upset they don't do anything. But little Ben Bentley, the two-year-old, steps in. He's the man with the plan. He grabs the smartphone and then FaceTimes her friend Connie. FaceTime is where you grab the phone, hit FaceTime so they can see you. Connie sees little Bentley. Here's the distress. Here's Laura uh, basically yelling for help in the background. 911 is called. And thanks to Bentley's quick thinking, mom is okay and healing. Mom is with us now. Laura, how are you doing after that traumatic experience? I'm doing really well, thank you. So you, you got your hands in there as two dogs are getting after it. That's always dangerous, right? And your finger paid the price. Yep, I had to get my hand in there. That's, I wasn't thinking about the pain I was going to have. I just knew I had to save my little dog. Save the doggie. Uh, what about Bentley? He's the man, isn't he? He is. What was that he... boy, he knows how to use those phones. Uh, so what was his demeanor as, as all this is happening? And I'm imagining it's very upsetting. What, what's he doing? <laughs> He was very calm. He knew that I was in need of help. And when he came walking at me with that dish towel, I knew he was going to help me. <laughs> Where my two four-year-olds, they were screaming just oh, along yeah. with me because uh, I was quite hysterical um, from the blood. And Bentley just took charge. He took my phone, cleaned off my phone screen. And the next thing I could hear was my best friend on the phone um, saying hi to Bentley. And I started screaming for help. There and that's go. how we were able to get help. Well... What a man, Bentley. I had a chance to talk to him a little bit earlier. He and I FaceTimed, uh, and his sisters were there. Dad was there. So let's let you listen to that. We'll get your take coming out. Okay. Tell me what you did with the phone when Mom was hurt. What'd you do, Bentley? What did you call when Mommy got hurt? Connie! Yay for Connie. We had a foster dog, and she, she bit Bruno, huh? A foster dog, and she bit Bruno. And my mom, too. So she went over there and put her on the... Oh. And, and separated them, huh? And separating them. So how does he know what to do with the FaceTime? Because a lot of adults don't know how to use that. Well, he started off doing it by accident. And <laughs> now he can, if we ask him to call somebody, he, he'll go to the phone, he'll unlock it, and he'll go through the contacts and he'll find it. Does he like to prank people with the FaceTime? He, he doesn't so much prank, he just calls and hangs up right away because he just likes to, he likes to push buttons. Hey, Bentley, you know something? You're a superhero. What do you think of that? There's Superman, Spider-Man, and Bentley. <laughs> Spider-Man's his favorite one. Yeah, you're right up there with Spider-Man. You saved your mom. Everybody's loving that. Come on, Mom, what's your reaction to all that? Even your little girls were in there. I love that. I had no doubt the girls would be joining in. They did. I was trying to ask Bentley questions, and Mackenzie and Alyssa were, an were answering for him. Uh, oh, that's how it is. That's part for the course, huh? Yep. So, I mean, how adept is he? I'm sure a lot of parents, you know, oh, get the kids away from the tablets and the smartphones. Yeah. Oh, the technology's ruining them. What's he like? I mean, what, and what have you guys taught him, or has he just taught himself? He figured out on his own from watching my husband and I use FaceTime <laughs> how to call his grandparents. He loves to call his grandparents constantly. Or um, uh, even some of my friends, the ones that we call often, he loves to call those numbers. And he, he knows. He has the, like a photo recognition of the name, and he'll find them in my contacts, and he'll push FaceTime. Well, number one, you've got a sweet family. Again, I had a chance to talk to everybody. And by the way, uh, little Bentley was decked out in his diaper, and he was eating chocolate cupcakes so great day for him as we acknowledged him as a hero a good day. yeah is that a good day for him <laughs> and your sweet little girls as well and gosh get well you know it sounds like you're healing okay and you're past the worst of it so thanks again really appreciate it thank you all right laura there sharing her story and her family story and of course bentley our new superhero